Hello Church on a Budget family, today I'm going to show you how we use uh, green screen to show our lower thirds and our lyrics and our announcements para sa services namin. So check this video out. So ito, we will start with our presentation software. In our church, we use Easy Worship 2009. So etong gagawin natin, i-import lang tayo ng any song. So ito, i-add natin dito is Graves into Gardens by Elevation Worship. And as you can see, ang background ng song na to is color green. So let's just see here, green siya dito sa background. So all of our backgrounds, for our lyrics are color green. So, ito yung lyrics namin. They are all lined up. Make sure lang na you can see it like this dito. Ganyan yung format niya. Okay? It's in the lower third. How do you do that? You actually go to your format dito. Format namin. And then you choose a song specifically. You choose center and then bottom. Alright? Kasi pag ito naka-center, hangat siya doon. Pero dapat ito naka-bottom. Okay. Sa font namin, we decided to go sa 7. Uh, that worked for us perfectly. And then ito yung font na ginagamit namin. It's CMG Sans Semi Bold. Ayun. So we chose this font because it looked good to us. So we tried different fonts. We tried Poppins. We tried all the Sans na fonts. But um, this font worked for us. So, ito, may shadow din kami and outline. We just chose the lightest sa weight para lang ma-separate siya sa video na. So, ayun. Press OK and that's it. So, ayun, nakikita nyo ngayon, naka-overlay siya dyan. Ganyan yung itsura at just one click of a button here sa switcher namin. Nasho-show siya at na-off. So, ayun. So when you go to the ATEM control here in the upper right, you will you will see the palettes, okay, palettes yan, and then you will see color generators. And what we need here is the upstream key, all right, upstream key, because uh, this will be our overlay. Now there are four options: Luma, Chroma, Pattern, and DVE. Choose the Chroma, okay, and then Fill Source should be number four, kasi nga nasa number four yung uh, media natin ng computer. So, choose number 4 and then chroma sample. Very important. Uh, itong chroma sample is very simple. Just click that para ma-set mo to and then find a spot dyan sa screen mo. Yung spot na yan will tell the ATEM control na, oy, etong spot na to, etong color na to are the colors that I don't need. So, take them away. So, eto actually. So, dito sa switcher natin makikita natin may box. Ayun. As I move it here, namamove din siya. So, eto yung color na ayun na in interpret ni item na oh these are the colors i will remove so ayun when you set that automatic yung color na yan you just turn that off and then when you press okay the key button right here then item will do the magic for you all right when you press this so look at that when you press key pow right there okay na trigger nito it will become red because it is triggering now as key so pag off Ayun. On. Right. Alright, so that's it for lyrics. Uh, we use green screen and even yung mga overlays namin for word ni Pastor and his slides. We do a separate edit naman. The software we use there is a PowerPoint presentation by Microsoft. Uh, it's the same concept. Green screen pa rin because we want all the greens to be removed. Bakit green? Green kasi green is a color we don't usually use dito sa live stream namin and sa church na setting and it's fine for us. And up next, I will show you how we show our announcements and videos uh, during the service proper, okay? Here we go. Okay, so here, uh, as soon as you click that dito sa computer, it will automatically show here. Very important, you don't need to turn on the key button right here because you're actually showing the full uh, video so you don't need to remove all the greens in this video so be careful turn this off when you are showing announcements or videos that um, are you know using full frame sa video niyo so you can just 
leave it there and just choose camera 4 dito sa switch niya. Another thing that we do for our video are lower thirds for our speakers. So in this case, our pastor. I will show you now uh, what it looks like during preaching so that for the visitors sa live stream natin, uh, they will know who our pastor is or who is speaking in front. This is a very powerful tool we can use so that people will be guided no, sa names ng mga pastors or speakers natin who are coming up stage. So, here it is. Let me show it to you. Here it is, uh, Easy Worship namin. I'm gonna play it and right there is a screen natin. It will show immediately. Now, back to the still image for now since wala tayong camera. Uh, let me play the video for you. Right there. Don't forget your key. Alright? A uh, very important thing to take note when doing green screens is to have the same green color <laughs> that you use for all your videos and photos because this will help the switcher no, uh, maintain its setting so that when you switch from video to photo, uh, the switcher will automatically detect the green, the specific color of green that you want to remove. So very very important, uh, I encourage you to even use a hex code para talagang consistent yung greens na ginagamit niya. Alright? So that is the end of the video. Thank you so much for checking it out. Thank you for what you're doing sa church ninyo week in and week out. You know, you can keep on serving, you keep on doing what you do excellently. And this is one of this. You know, if this content has helped you, like the video, share it to your friends, and even comment down below if you have some questions. And never forget, to lay hands on that subscribe button so you won't miss a video I will be releasing this coming day. So thank you so much everybody. If you have some content suggestions, please comment down below so I can make a video especially for you. Thank you so much and peace y'all.